beloved people of God, I greet you all in the name of Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Every day with the Holy Spirit named small message, I just want to welcome you to this message. God has guided you so far and he will guide us continuously. Our Redeemer lives. Amen. Praise be to God. You are not hearing this message yourself. God has given you opportunity to hear it. Amen. Early in the morning at 5.30, this uh, message has been recorded and uploaded to you, okay? But uh, I don't know at what time you are seeing it, but I believe that this is the word of the heart to you. I tell you, this is a prophetic word of this hour for you. In this God's time, what God is speaking to you, let me take you to Ephesians chapter 6, verses 18. Praying always with all your prayer and supplication and spirit, being watchful to this end with all the perseverance and supplications for all the saints. In one word, if you say, praying in the spirit and being watchful, praying in spirit. Prayer means we can pray in Hindi, English or Tamil, whatever language it is. In different languages we can pray, we all know that. But praying in the Spirit means, for example, we are guided by the Holy Spirit, right, every day. We say, Lord, you guide us, you speak to us, Lord, you do it, Lord. If it is your will, I'll go or else no, Lord. This is what we live in the Spirit. I believe that you are living such a life. But here, it's saying that praying in the Spirit means, for one thing, if you have burden in your heart, Spirit of the Lord, you are making me a burden for that. But uh, how should I pray? In what way I should pray and petitions to be sent to you, Lord? That's what uh, is I should pray. So what you should do, you should pray in the tongues, pray with great burden until the burden is removed from you. You need to thank God, praise God in tongues and just praise Him forever. Then, when you surrender yourself into the hands of the Lord, if there's a burden which is incapable for you, which is not tolerable to you, you should say, Lord, this I am unable to handle it. I don't know how to pray. When you speak in tongues continuously by saying that, I tell you, every promise will display. It will come in front of your eyes. It will come in your thoughts. And immediately when you confess those promises, I tell you, God will give you new strength to you and you will be comforted and a great comfort will come into your heart and you will know that, Lord, you heard my prayer. I thank you for that. That's what we call it as praying in spirit. In this experience, there may be some people who go every day to their works and they will not have time to pray. At least once in two days, you should give such time for prayer and you should come to the presence of the Lord. I tell you, you should come to the presence of the Lord. I tell you, you will be blessed. Be bold. God will take care of everything. God will be your shield. Don't be worried about it. He will take care of everything. Okay? We'll see you again. Don't forget to share to other people. You should pray more for the Hindi-speaking people. Thank you. See you again. Our address, Jesus Smith Ministries, number 4, Kavarapalaya Main Road, Avadi, Chennai 54, India. Telephone number 9841252836, 7299546363. Email ID, gpsrobinson at hotmail.com, gps.office at jesusmeets.org. Website address, www.gpsrobinson.org.